came in like a wrecking ball. That's the message for today. Someone has moved through the storm by realizing that they were the storm. But what I'm getting here is that this is an emotional storm that has like torn through your life, but you've shifted your perspective and realized that the same storm that maybe that had been creating chaos is the very same storm that cleared the path that you're walking on. Like the emotional chaos that you'd been going through not only humbled you, but like now you're balancing and transforming all that into peace into your life. Um, whoever this is for, you've really come to this balance in like in your heart space. Like I'm, I'm seeing fours here and fours are all about stability and balance. And like they're referencing and like they're like lighting up like the four chambers of the heart. And like also referencing the four cardinal directions. Like you've been working really hard in this space to understand that like your emotions are like a compass, right? They're like a compass. This card has number, it's 50 on it, but it's five. Five is all about movement. And so like the, you know, you understanding that your emotions are like this compass and they guide you to address and deal with things in your life, but you are actually changing this and you're mastering moving through your emotions by taking control in this space and making conscious decisions to heal. You're no longer suppressing the shadow side of yourself and you are realizing that you're no longer getting stuck in that storm and that you are now bridging from this heart space into your throat, into like your throat chakra, right? That's like the next energy center up. <laughs> and like my team saying, hell, let me clear my throat. Like you're speaking some fiery truth. Like others might perceive your truth as you throwing shade, but like, you're just tired of being silenced and like I'm hearing all the gloves are off like again you, you've taken control of this situation and you understand like like I said there's some real fiery ass energy here but like I'm not getting that in the sense of like burning it down type of deal. I'm getting the understanding that this is like you're really harnessing and understanding the power of your sacred fire. And like you're not willing to water yourself down anymore and not for anyone or anything. Like you're really looking at it, it's your, your relationships and like you know the part that you play in them but you're really realizing that like the people that are around you might not like this new version of you because in order to stay in your space, they're going to have to facilitate growth in their own space. Like the alignment you're in is directly related to the lessons that you're going to learn. The my team saying align accordingly. Like the, the tides have turned in your life and like you're literally learning to ride these waves now and like just kind of fitting because like we're now in Venus retrograde and like the fact that you're learning how to ride these waves means you're flowing with things like you're no longer blocking yourself like you have crossed this bridge between your heart space and, and your in your throat chakra and like I said you're no longer silencing yourself like this is the bridge this is the path this is what you had to cross because until you're walking in your truth and speaking your truth you can't live in your truth I mean your throat goes up here into your crown so like until you bridge this space fully and understand that like you're never going to physically get that into your reality so like who's ever working really hard on this lesson like dude like round of applause to you like you are legitimately understanding that you are in control like you you are your compass and hold on here I got a card that's upside down in my deck <laughs> What do we just say? Ride the wave. This is all about change. And there's your metamorphosis card. Keep doing you. I'm proud of you. Love you guys.